Hello everyone, in this tutorial I am going to show you how you can download the Django project from github and run it on your local laptop or PC. So this is really simple. So here you can see we are in github and this is a Django project. So first of all we need to download this project. So in order to download it we need to click on this code option and here you can see we have download zip option here. Just click on it and it will start downloading a zip file here. There you can see. And it will take some time depending on the file size. So I'll just fast forward the video. And there you can see the download is complete. So when the download is complete, just go to the download location. And here you can see this is the downloaded file. So right now I'm just going to cut this zip file from here. And let me just put it in my desktop directly. Just paste it here. And let's go and extract this zip file. For it, we'll just right click then click on extract all then click on extract so this will extract the zip file and the extract is complete so here you can see we have a folder over here called python django blog website so let's just go inside then let's go inside this folder as well so after coming here you need to go to at the top and here you need to write cmd then press enter so this will open a command prompt like this. Let me just zoom in. There you can see. So here, first of all, we need to create a virtual environment. In order to create a virtual environment, we need to say here Python minus M P E N V. Then we need to mention the folder name, which would be ENV. So you can give this folder name anything you want, but I will recommend you to give the folder name ENV. So right now, if we press enter, it will create an env folder here. Let me just press enter. And there you can see it created an env folder over here. So after that, we need to activate this virtual environment. So for it, we need to say here env slash scripts. S will be capital. Again, slash. We need to say here activate dot fact. Then press enter. So if the virtual environment is activated, then you will see this over here. So right now we need to give one more command to install the necessary package for this project. For it, we need to say here pip install minus r requirements.txt. I mean txt, not text. It will be txt. Then press enter. So it will install some necessary package for this project. So this will take a few seconds and there you can see it is done. After that, here you can see we have a database over here called SQLite. So right now we need to make some migration for this SQLite. And make sure that you have SQLite installed on your Windows. So once you have SQLite installed on your Windows, you need to write this command python manage.py make migrations and press enter right now we are going to say python manage dot ui migrate press enter again so the table is migrated right now we need to run our project in order to run the project we need to say python manage dot py then we need to say run server press enter and there you go our project is running so here you can see we have a link here we just need to copy this then let's go to our browser paste it here press enter and there you can see this is our python project and we are able to successfully run our project so thank you very much for watching i hope right now you are able to run your python project download it from github but if you are still facing some issues then let me know in the comment section i will try to help you as much as possible make sure to subscribe and i hope to see you in the future tutorials